growers it's Lynn here and uh, I've got a wonderful new addition to our bromeliard and Tillandsia family to share with you today. Now um, this is a collection of our bromeliards that we have here in our little bathroom window and we grow them alongside some of our Tillandsia air plants as well. We have quite a lot of air plants throughout the house and we have a collection here in the bathroom and our bromeliards and I'm going to talk about the bromeliards we've got here but this is our gorgeous new beautiful bromeliard that we got from Little Supermarket the other day and this one is I've wrote down the name of it a bit of a tongue twister to pronounce this is Guzmania lingulata and it's commonly known as the scarlet star plant absolutely beautiful and it's already in bloom very gorgeous, gorgeous red uh, bloom there, very beautiful, beautiful bromeliard. And uh, I'm going to show you some of the other bromeliards that we've got in our collection. And uh, happy to say this is a very um, oldish bromeliard we've had for quite a few years now. It was one little plant and it's sort of grown lots of pups and very large now, just show that compared to my hand. Got a couple of our air plants in there as well. And it's coming up into bud, which is really exciting. You can see there the big flower bract forming. But this is blooming for us for the first time after two years. So it's very exciting to see the lovely big flower bract forming there. And then this one here is our Tillandsia diariana. And uh, I also see that the bromeliards come under Tillandsias as well and it's a bit, a bit confusing because the Tillandsias air plants are also part of the bromeliard family because of their flower bracts that they form. But this is also um, multi-pupped as well, lovely beautiful plant and look at this, this is coming out with a huge big flower spike here and uh, that's the beautiful colourful flower bract there you can see with my hand and uh, the little flowers come out at the end of the flower bracts and little little white flowers coming out here at the end so that's in beautiful beautiful flower bract and the blooms are starting to come up on that one and here we have our this is also our Tillandsia um, Cyanea and this is also blooming beautiful as you can see we've had this plant for probably about three years also it's one we got from Lidl's too and uh, very happy to see it's in beautiful beautiful pink flower bracts there's two of them there as you can see and a uh, beautiful little beautiful purple flowers coming out and these are the old flower bracts from last year I sort of leave them on but prune them back I'm happy to see so we've got quite a few blooming and as I say I wanted to share a lovely new addition with you so I hope you enjoy the gorgeous new plant, could not resist. As I say, there's always room for one more or a few more. So thanks so much for watching everybody. And if you haven't done already, please do subscribe. Don't forget to click the notification bell. And uh, also please give this video a like. And you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook at Desert Plants of Avalon. I want to send you loads of love, heaps of happiness and tons and tons of plant power from across the Emerald Isle. And until my next video, bye.